Get Fixed Boy was the new hardest difficulty introduced by Terraria 1.4.4, and Calamity is currently the biggest mod on the Terraria scene. So what if we just mash them together? Oh, you should not have come here. Why did you come here? Let me out of the box, please! Let me out! <laughs> oh, I'm done carrying you guys. I knew things would get easier after Moon Lord. I don't Why know, is it small? small? It's so tiny! It's, it's small! small. <laughs> I found a special treasure chest. You want to check it out? Ravager has been removed from the game. There's no reason to spawn it anymore. Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> oh, no! Plague. We got him! Oh, what the heck am I looking oh, at? Oh, that doesn't look right. <laughs> oh, what is that? that? Big uh, beam. That's not normal. <laughs> it has legs. I can't get over this. It's 500,000. Yes, he's dead. What the oh, heck? Hey, what's up, lady? Smooch. Welcome back to Calamity Get Fixed Boy on Legendary Difficulty, the hardest uh, mod or difficulty I've ever played in Terraria. So uh, it's pretty interesting. And we got past Moonlord last time. So now we're going straight to the end game. And Snake Boy decided he was going to fight Moonlord while we were waiting for the other two to join the world. And of course, it spawned on me rather than on him, which is just a fantastic. <laughs> but that makes sense. Th th why? What's wrong? <laughs> it's just the two of us. Just the two of us. Switch to pink say. team. Also, I'm not even. No. no! We did need some more Luminite, though, and I was told he drops a rogue weapon, and we didn't get it the last time. So we spent some time trying to beat this thing again. Oh, oh is it? Oh, goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> Go, Abomna. <laughs> Wait, you guys are both dead? Oh, no. Come on, no, no, no faster. Right, no, no, I'm dead. <laughs> oh, oh, he right, joined. Right as he joined. <laughs> guys, I'm here. It's kind of funny how we get worse at boss fights. I wasn't really taking the whole thing seriously and figured I'd grab the Rod of Discord, which in this mod has a chance to spawn what might as well be an unkillable boss. I just couldn't seem to get the boys to notice the implications of what I was doing. Stay, stay right there. I want, I want to get inside the in the box, you see. Wonderful. I had to wait until Billy showed up before someone sort of caught on to the whole issue, though the boss hadn't spawned yet, weirdly enough. Yeah, wait, what the heck am I looking at? I want it. I really want this thing off my screen. <laughs> I want it. What is this? It's a uh, range accessory. What's it oh. called? What? It happened that time. <laughs> Please. Let me out of the box, please! Let me out! We fought Moonlord a little more and moved on to Ashram Deus. De Deus? De what is this? I know we're at the post-Moonlord phase of the game, and we start off by fighting Moonlord and a pre-Moonlord boss, but you know what? We weren't able to beat this worm, and we weren't able to beat Ravager either, but we'll get to him later. For now, we're just trying to focus on Astrum Deus. De we'll just stick with Deus. If you're doing more than 15 damage per second, we might have a chance. Ah, I did 50 when he had only took oh. one damage a second. Actually, it's still only registering as 50 damage a second. That's not good. Something what? is very what? wrong. What, what, is did, what was what that? Is this? If you had a DPS meter, how much DPS in real life would you do? At least three. That's true. I mean, I do a lot of emotional damage, so... <laughs> Plus 100 emotional damage per second. That's crazy. Yeah, I got, like, all the worms on me, and I'm not about? doing a lot of damage. I'm very confused. Oh, that's just this boss. Don't worry. Well, beforehand, I Although would get up to like 2,000. When it's like 50, that's, yeah, something. Yeah, it is. Actually, I see the numbers above it. It's just registering as one. Maybe, I don't know. That weapon could just be broken. I don't know. I tried all my weapons. You must have an accessory on or something you don't know about. Yeah. Oh, wait, he's got the, he, you have the camper on. <laughs> what, how would that affect anything? If you're moving, the camper does like no damage. Yeah. Oh, yeah. we, we probably could have beat Moonlord and other bosses then. Yeah, we probably could have. Apparently this accessory brings my DPS down to zero if I'm moving around. Good to know. I am thoroughly embarrassed and we were totally right in our assessment that we could beat the bosses once I was um no longer holding a thing that reduced my damage output to one. <laughs> Now that the worm is dead, we can mine what I think is astral ore, and Billy is trying to chase everybody away as he mines it for us. He just wants to hi ho the hog all the cosm- or astral bars for himself. Yes. 100% that's what I'm gonna do. Never trust your friends. Ever. I mined some of the ore myself, just in case. This leaves the only remaining pre-Moon Lord boss, Ravager. We tried to kill the thing, figuring we were powerful enough now, but as it would turn out, the Ravager gets a buff after beating Moon Lord, and so our hopes of being strong enough were crushed. Alright, well, we tried. I uh, haven't tried hard enough. 
We tried. You still want to try that? I didn't make them fight the Ravager anymore yet, so we moved on to the first post Moon Lord boss of the run, the Profaned Guardians. Oh yeah, if you use this on Ravager, then we might win. Or we could go fight the Chicken Balls, or the Chicken Balls. Chicken Balls. Are they more widely known as the Chicken Balls? I, I have no idea. These guys just keep calling them the Chicken Balls. Do other people call them the Chicken Balls? I just hear these guys calling them that, so that's what they are to me. Uh, did they re sprite these things? What the heck? Oh, uh, yes. Yeah, there's no dungeon. They look kind of cool. Not sure really. Oh, I perished. How he died. Imagine dying. Yeah, I can't. Yeah. Kind of yeah. Oh, I'm done carrying you guys. You know what? <laughs> it's over. It's still going of... hitless. Let's go. Hey, look, there's a platform. This is going to be an easy boss. We're going to first try this one. I'm feeling it. Hey, guys, don't worry. I'm doing like a thousand DPS. All right, just the command, just the last one. Oh my god, this <laughs> kind of the heck? I got zoomed. This is now the real boss fight starts or something. I don't know. Probably. Oh, well, look, it's the province projectiles. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, we did. A, we just got. We just got bonked. It's also kind of buggy, so he just kind of teleports. It's pretty cool. Oh, <laughs> run! <laughs> oh, oh my gosh! <laughs> <Please. laughs> 50%. That's so scary. Yes, adrenaline, die! Die! Wow. Die! Yes, kill it, please. Oh my gosh, dude! Don't like those projectiles. It oh, dude, it's only there. at 25! Let's go! Come on! Don't don't you dare dash at me, please. Please, have mercy. Please! Ten. Ouch. Oh, he's on me. Oh, leave me alone. No, leave me alone. <laughs> Help me out, Pelosi, come on! No. Eight. Ah! Oh, Jake. Oh, oh, so what did he spawn? I think that doesn't even count as a try, so we can still first try this thing. True, I mean, we didn't lose. We didn't, so. we didn't lose. And since we can still first try this thing, we move the battle over to our arena with a dirt box because Snake Boy just wanted that a lot. It's, the box is not at all viable for this boss, but at the very least, we have some vertical movement options with this arena as well as healing stations and all that set up. Wait, it, it left. Coming him for the third time, and we get an easy victory now that the coward can't flee. Let's Dead. go. Easy kills. We never even lost. Ah, I knew things would get easier after Moon Lord. Thing is, Snake Boy thought it would be funny to summon the next boss, Providence, immediately after our victory. Whoa, what Bag? the heck? Uh huh. Why did this Why? Why? It's nighttime. it's nighttime, and I didn't even spawn it. I don't Why know. Why is it small? It's so tiny. It's, it's small. small. What? Uh, I think we're doing pretty good right now. Also, I definitely didn't spawn Change it. Change it. No, you didn't. Um. We can no. win this, uh, Snake Boy. Yeah. Well, if we win, I'll I'll admit that I spawned it. Otherwise, I won't admit it. Dude, we're we're cooking right now, though. We can get we like can both cook better. better. I'm not even like taking that much damage. We're doing fine. Actually, I'm not either. I mean, just we, we both are barely doing any damage to it. Yeah, yeah, but you know, it's better than being dead. I almost died when I'm actually that. really surprised that she, she doesn't do, do like infinite damage when she hits you. It doesn't actually say on the wiki that she is the size. Oh, does it say anything about her size being different? That's uh, interesting. This is uncharted territory. We have discovered something new. But what guys? Low. She's doing so little damage. What if we just stand in the box? I'm not even kidding. Hold on. Try it. Let me in. She's doing more damage now that I'm in the box. It's, yeah, it's I'm off. dying. <laughs> Goodbye. Yeah, I'm not getting, I'm getting out of the box. Wow, she is tanky. Yeah. I sure hope she doesn't have other phases where she does more damage. <laughs> no. That never. Is, what, calamity box having other phases? That never happens. <laughs> you can have two box thumbnails when we kill every boss post Moon Lord in this box. <laughs> <laughs> She's at 56%. Yeah. Guys, first try Providence. Oh, hey, she's just in rage still, by the way, the whole time. Oh, nice. Um, there's also a, a, a special surprise to 50%. Oh. Uh, is it just that we die immediately? LOL. Ha ha ha. We're at 50. Uh, where's the special surprise, Wiki? Yeah, we're definitely below 50. Well, the Wiki uh, doesn't even say she's small, so I don't know. This is such a weird fight. I don't this, understand. Yeah, I am very like, confused right now. Like, is this difficult or not? Like, it's just like, she's not even doing it that much damage, but also it's impossible to dodge anything. So there's that. I do know that if you get hit a whole bunch of times consecutively, you'll take a lot more damage because it yeah, that, debuffs your defense. Oh, she just spawned the guardians and I oh, almost died. Oh boy. Wait, I'm actually going to die. Oh no. There we go, Provin. They're, they're gone. 
Are they all gone? Yep. Back in we go. Back to box. <laughs> oh shoot. Dude, the box actually stops those lasers, I just realized. Oh yeah. <laughs> those amazing. lasers that do five damage. Yes. Well, I mean, the debuff's kind of bad. Look, let me just praise the box and all its glory. <laughs> I swear, if we die, I'm gonna quit. I swear, I hate I, th there's it. gonna be something that ends up killing it's us. It's gonna be a like, desperation phase. Something, yeah, exactly. Like something stupid is gonna end up happening. Okay, Come I got some hearts. Come on, no. mage the tank. Yeah, mage the tank. Two <laughs> percent. Come on. Come on. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good. She's stuck at one percent. Oh no. Plus point no, five. No, we're, we're, Wait, she's taking one damage. No, she's not. Uh, you have the spawn down, Jake. Point four. No, she huh? is. Point three. No, no she's she's point literally two. taking one damage. Yeah, I see. Or, or wait, I see no, that. wait, wait. She's taking more now. She's taking more. I think. I mean, she's. she's dead. Oh, she's dead. Dude, what? Yes, let's go. We first try. <laughs> Dude, I literally spawned that as a joke. Okay. <laughs> I'll admit that I spawned it because we won. That boss is usually so difficult. I can't hardly believe it was that easy. But my joy from winning was interrupted by this really weird mimic. If I run into it, I take damage. But it won't attack me and I can't attack it. It's just a random chest that does damage to me and I can't interact with it in any way. Guys, I found a special treasure chest. You want to check it out? Oh, a chest. Oh, oh it actually attacked you. Wait. <laughs> Where'd the chest go? Huh? I've been standing here this entire time and it wasn't attacking me. <laughs> and Dude, I, I, it was like nice to you. There were all kinds of things we could craft and what have you. The alpha virus. Oh. <laughs> but the problem with Calamity multiplayer at this point in game is that all the weapons have so many gosh darn projectiles. We're yeah. definitely at a point where uh, good luck seeing the projectiles of the boss. Oh, I know. Once again, I figured we could kill Ravager. We got to be strong enough now, right? With all of our post Moon Lord stuff, we got to be strong enough. Or maybe... Oh, wait a minute. Was I wrong earlier about Ravager upgrading after Moon Lord? Maybe it's Providence. Because my damage output does not feel any different despite considerably stronger weapons. And... The boys were still dragging their feet, trying to craft and be productive, and were no longer interested in fighting this boss. Ravager is evil, never spawned again. What's a Ravager? There's no such thing. Whoa. Ravager has been removed from the game. There's no reason to spawn it anymore. You're, tr you're right. It didn't work. You're right. <laughs> um, yeah, so apparently he has more health post Providence. Oh, well, so we're, we're never killing that We're boss. never yeah, no. killing this thing. We're literally never killing <laughs> Well, I guess that answers that question. He is upgraded after Providence. Great. Uh, we should have tried harder after beating Moon Lord. Now we're just stuck with him being too tough once again. Guess the only option is the Dragon Folly. I think that one's technically meant to be fought before Providence, but Snake Boy spawned Providence early, okay? There it is. Okay, yeah, Whoa. it actually isn't jungle down here anymore. <laughs> Uh, it's uh, oh, it's a bunch of small ones. Where were the? Oh my gosh, there's so many. They do a lot of damage. And of course, it does. Yeah, 500 damage. Wow, everyone died already. That's. Oh, the, the, it's the bubble burb. The bubble burb's back. Wait, really? <laughs> Wait, did it actually spawn? Bumble burb has killed every player. Wait, really? Bumble I'm burb. so excited. Wait, wait, was it the bumble burb spray? No. Oh. If you don't know, Dragonfall used to be called Bumbleburb and had this funny golden chicken looking sprite. It's neat that they have a callback to it and all, but my takeaway from the previous battle is the fact that we all died so quickly. This is the legendary Calamity Get Fixed Boy we've all grown so accustomed to. We're doing a lot better on the, this fight. <laughs> the last one. Oh boy. Oh my goodness. First, you just had to talk, didn't you? Yeah, you really <laughs> did. But as it would turn out, I was right, because we beat the thing on the second attempt and we're all scratching our heads. We've beaten three post Moon Lord bosses and have only lost once. This isn't right. We took 10 or more tries against several bosses in hard mode. This is weird, and we're just waiting for the other shoe to drop for everything to just get exponentially harder. Next up are the three bosses, Ceaseless Void, Stormweaver, and Cygnus. The first we decided to fight was Stormweaver, and we chose that one because Billy told us, and he wanted to craft a weapon for himself. Now the way this boss functions is in its first form, you can only hit the tail to do damage similar to Crawltipedes, but actually worse in some ways. You can hit the main body, 
but you'll only do one damage, which you might think is nice because you're doing one instead of zero damage, but this also means the body will block your projectiles from hitting the tail, which would actually allow you to do real damage. We were dying a lot to this boss, but it never managed to kill all of us, so we could keep fighting, and I came to a realization. Whenever we're at this arena, we just die a lot. <laughs> I know. But yeah, this is our we die a lot arena. Yeah. Die a lot to it a worm, so even well. more specifically. <laughs> yeah, uh, he's in actually, actually, <laughs> that, that worm takes 30 minutes, too. That's another trope of yeah. this arena. It's a worm. We die a lot. Yeah, so at least we get the fight dog up here too. That, that's, that's what that means, right? So worms, lots of deaths, long battles. This arena has a terrible pattern. But while Astrum Deus took several attempts, we managed to kill this worm on our first one. Guys, really we good. first tried almost every boss so far. Yeah, what is this? I don't like where this is going. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're, we're in for something really awful. Hey, yeah, man. Ah, uh, dog. <laughs> I'm just gonna say it, it's dog. We crafted a few more items. Same. We got the plague. No. Yeah. Now you do too. Oh, here, have some You've plague yourself. Oh no, plague. I have the plague. Next to the two we took on was Cygnus. Back to the box arena. Oh, he does a lot of damage. Yeah, he seems to not really care about your box very much. I'm not gonna lie to you. Um, <laughs> I mean, hey, if I wasn't in the box and I was standing still, I'd be dead by now. Uh, you're dead I instantly now. died. And we were doing pretty good job against him. Oh, that. your thickness. Oh, what? Thickness? <laughs> Maybe that's why I'm doing so good, because he's thick. <laughs> and so, once again, we beat a boss on the first attempt. But that's fine, because the boss dropped a material that allowed me to craft a super cool rogue accessory, which allows me the ability to teleport, which I was so excited about. Oh, no. Yeah, Nate, why would you... The oh, no, no, that wasn't me. I used it like forever ago. Yeah, it, Chaos State gives it to you. It's not the. Yeah, Chaos State Discord. lasts for like 10 seconds. Oh, so it's just being in Chaos State. Oh, so this like, this really cool accessory I got, I can't even use. <laughs> so excited. I'm not giving it up. Shut up. I'm not giving it up. Uh, I love it. But I love her. <laughs> I just about didn't give it up, but these are the sacrifices you gotta make for the content. We can't beat the other bosses, like the next one, the Ceaseless Void, if I'm teleporting everywhere and summoning an unkillable worm. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Uh, you know, we've killed things in a rage Whoa. like before. What's the difference? This seems a little, um, they don't cook. not great. <laughs> This is going to be the hardest one, probably. We actually lost that fight, so that's new. Um, we headed down into the dungeon because the boys figured summoning the boss down there would prevent him from being enraged, which is how it works in regular Calamity, apparently. There's only one problem with this, and that's that killing a certain number of enemies in the dungeon will result in Poltergast spawning. He's roughly at the same level as Ceaseless Void, so it's not that big of a deal. He's not that much of a jump, but we weren't exactly ready for it. I mean, it's, it's like a couple enemies away from just straight up. Yep. Oh, oh I, why when I left? I think we made an arena. <laughs> Turns out Poltergast hasn't actually been changed hardly at all, and the boss fight was incredibly easy. Is it mirror? Does this seem kind of normal? It does. Oh yeah, Disable's music is actually one of the changes. Wait, really? Yeah. <laughs> His last phase was a little more difficult, but I only died once and got adrenaline several times, and the ghostly plant died after one attempt. What? It says a boomer awaits? What? He's dead. All right. What? A boomer? A boomer awaits. <laughs> Wait, what? Now we're like, what, halfway through post Moonlord bosses? Well, in sure quantity, we're probably over, but several of the bosses thus far are tied with another boss. We soon after summon Ceaseless Void, and it turns out he's enraged in the dungeon as well, so we summon him again outside the dungeon in the uh, bigger arena, and took him down on the third attempt, making him the toughest boss thus far post Moonlord. You know what's next? Let's go. <laughs> oh, I, I don't want to think about what's next. Hey, what is next? Is that dog? <laughs> It's Ravager. extra dog. Oh, Ravager. Ravager! I'm honestly a little worried. The later bosses have to be harder than this, right? After hard mode, I was ready for us to reach a point where we'd actually quit because the bosses were literally impossible to beat. And yet, here we are cruising through post Moonlord. Devourer of Gods was by far the hardest boss for us in our Infernum run, so we were pretty scared to fight him in Legendary Kid Fix Boy. But now is the time. Guys, I have oh. a melee weapon. Oh, why am I going up so much? What? Oh, uh, yeah. 
<laughs> oh no! <laughs> hey, yeah, moving his thing. Wait, there's a sky island above me though. Yeah, this is so stupid. So if you if you dash, it just sends you up into the air. I don't I don't know what you guys are talking about. Like I no, used my not... dash and I just went flying upward. Oh. Yeah, that's a you problem. Yeah, that's on the you. Well, oh, that's a I'm gonna try. And he only has three segments. Oh no, I just used my dash and I was fine. Okay, maybe I don't know what it is. Oh, yeah, his, oh, he, just, oh. he gives you a debuff to like warp gravity and stuff. I hate this. This fight is already hard. Well, like, how do you do the single player? <laughs> I, I don't. Build a sky bridge out of dirt oh. above your head. Oh, I'm ascending. Goodbye. Goodbye, <laughs> Snake yeah, Boy. I, you guys are having a problem. I'm not having any problems. I keep, if I mean, I keep bonking the island, so we're good there. But. That must be nice. I keep missing oh, it by I'm a flying I'm, I'm just making sure I stay underneath oh, oh, it, basically. It's oh, the only way I can learn. Oh. <laughs> we wanted to fight together. <laughs> we both, we both <laughs> oh, see, it does affect face. you guys, yeah. Oh, it's, just a, it's just a question that I, I have. I spawned in and he immediately hit me with gravity. I hope you guys have good muscle memory for oh, laser balls. balls. Nope. Muscle memory. I mean, kind of. I, I need to get my broom out, though. Oh, look, it's lasers. That's weird. I don't remember seeing any telegraphs. They're, oh, um, yeah. Nice, nice telegraph. Also, the laser does um, all your health. <laughs> and it's not telegraphed. Oh, uh, yeah. So at 60%, 60 it's going to be uh, very humorous what happens. Oh, yeah, I'm sure it he is. says. 60% is when he like goes into the portal. I don't know where he's space. Is he going into phase two or something? Where the heck is he? Oh, there he is. <laughs> <laughs> Shoot, I missed the island. No! <laughs> oh, did you get away? Oh, no, yeah, we both missed the island. Wait, why did you get my death message twice? It really emphasized how fast you just warped into space. <laughs> well, Xander, don't Three, uh -oh. two, two, one. one. Lift off. <laughs> <laughs> I just peed myself. <laughs> Leave me alone! I haven't seen Oh, he's just... doing a thing! He's oh. doing a thing! Yep, definitely. What? Oh! Um. Whoa! What did I just not over yet. see? Uh, uh, there's only. Tell me there's only one. Uh, what? D does he look like that for anybody else? What the heck am I looking at? I don't, I don't see anything. What? Oh! What? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> he just slipped <laughs> off four of us! What? He was like stretched! What was that? <laughs> That's not supposed to happen. <laughs> <laughs> you don't say. I really want to do that again. That was really funny. Oh, I'm down I for that. I don't want to play this game anymore. And that was the Devourer of Gods experience. The single most stretched texture I have ever seen in any mod, so no idea where the hitbox is supposed to be on this thing. We did okay, all things considered, but we could use a little help, at which point Winston comes across a yo-yo, whose description says it's good against the Devourer of Gods. None of us have a yo-yo build, not even a melee build, so that's not great, but if an item tells you it's outright good against a certain boss, you gotta try it. We farmed some bloodstone we needed to craft three yo-yos, one for all but one of us, leaving only Snake Boy to deal damage with a regular weapon. I was convinced this yo-yo might just be a troll, but then we summoned the worm again. Oh, we're doing good. Oh, holy cow! Oh, that immediately does went into space. That does a lot um, of damage against That does Tom. a lot of damage. Yeah, notice how he's already down 8% of his health. Yeah, I, yeah. I did notice that. I'm just holding it out. Yeah. Yep, just wait for him to come. Give me your Oh, hi. <laughs> <laughs> that was so Love the jump scare. It's actually scary. <laughs> this yo-yo does stupid damage and made the battle trivial. In single player, having a yo-yo build might be necessary, but with four of us, we were able to rotate our deaths pretty evenly and take down our most feared boss on the second attempt, making him no harder than any of the other bosses in post Moon Lord. He's oh, dead. dead! We got him! Oh, what the heck am I looking oh, at? That doesn't look right. <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> His sprite was a little broken. Dude, second try! How did we? I got the wand! What? Second yeah. try! This is actually insane. Yaren, the Exomex, and Supreme Calamitous are all that remain, and they better be tougher than these other bosses thus far, especially since Cosmolite let me craft this thing. I, my life is complete. I got a dragon. Yes! It's so cool. What is that thing? He's my favorite. I love him. He's my dragon. Oh, I don't remember. I love him so much. I will never let him go. I'm gonna steal it from him. Oops, I stepped on Do a pressure it. plate. Alright, my life is complete now. <laughs> we don't even need to finish the playthrough. Lord, take me nope. home.
Look, My work is complete. Lord, take me home. <laughs> work is done. But now we've beaten several bosses at this point, so we should be able to be Ravager now, right? Yeah, we're doing a little more damage, guys. A little more, but he's got more we're health. Doing a, the same amount of damage as we were post or pre Providence. I'm already dead, so. I at least was doing a lot more damage. <laughs> I mean, I was doing more, but like, oh, it's, it's he buffed. Has more <laughs> but, it, but like, in comparison, yeah, we, we, we literally can't be Ravager, but we can be Thogging in one try. Okay, that's awesome and cool. Let's try it again. Epic. One more time, one more time. <laughs> Just one more. <laughs> Die, stupid Ravager. Die! I ride my dragon. That's probably my mistake. Oh. I didn't stay on my dragon. Yes. This is so ridiculous! <laughs> it's kind of absurd. We're oh. doing it! This is the best we've ever done! It's not even halfway dead! Nope! <laughs> We're almost halfway there! Oh, please help me. <laughs> He's at 50%, guys! Let's go! Oh, I got Gaster Blaster. We're doing oh. it! Ravager hardest boss in Calamity. I got adrenaline on him. The, the, <laughs> oh, he's I got adrenaline he's and, and it was times, consistently hitting him. That's a lot of lasers. That's <laughs> a lot of lasers. Oh, it's literally Holy! Sans Undertale. Holy oh. cow. Leave me alone. I don't want to be the one being targeted right now. That would suck. <laughs> you can't even fall fast enough to get out of this. Oh my oh, goodness. What the this fuck? is this. <laughs> Oh, we, oh, oh, one more. Oh, we almost got it, though. It's so oh, close! No! 3.7. Oh, come on, survive. I'm trying. Come on, Bo. No! Wait. No. No! Oh, we're so <laughs> close. So close! I'm, I'm, I'm about to write a strongly worded letter to the Calamity devs. This gosh darn bots. Ravager should be the end game boss. You can't change my mind on that, but I guess I do have to admit that he isn't that bad because the battles are really short. I guess that's one positive with him that he isn't burning a whole lot of our time. But I suppose if we can't beat him post dog, we'll have to wait until after Yaren or something. Before him though, we have the acid rain and old duke and for some reason I thought the sulfuric sea was on the surface, but that's not where it is. Instead, there's the upside down abyss. Wait, what the We heck? have our aquatic scourge place. Yeah. There's a meteor that hit the that hit the inside of the abyss. Oh what? <laughs> oh that's so <laughs> Can we mine to it? Oh you should oh, have done that. Oh no. Xana, you right, have here. a drum out. Use a there. drum out. Oh I do. Oh, oh he died instantly. <laughs> <laughs> guys, there's a uh, high pressure in there. Oh we're dying. Oh boy guys, it's not. Wait, you hanging. die when you're over here? Oh my yeah. goodness, you don't even there's not even any water and it's still the pressure! No, Xander! This is, this is not good. No, this, this is bad. Xander, oh, stop. Oh, no. no. Oh, that's okay. Whew, we're safe. He we're safe. He didn't make Everybody it. Everybody get out. Everybody get out. Get out. <laughs> I don't think we no, have one. No, 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 no. Oh, this is so much water. This is so much water. Oh, no. so much water. I, I don't have uh, blocks. What is he doing? That's going down. We got Winston under control. Sort of. After he had mined a rather large hole into the abyss, summoning the acid rain kind of helped to uh, give everybody something to focus on. Oh, acid rain, more like easy rain. <laughs> Got him. Turns out the mod heard me and didn't like it. Where's There's my adrenaline? One. I demand. Oh, oh is that, that is a big uh, beam! It's not normal to help. <laughs> it did a thousand damage! Oh, I, and once we cleared the acid rain, the old duke makes his appearance. It's, it's so cool! Oh, and he's enraged. Why? I mean, it oh, we summoned old the duke? The sound is just broken. I forgot Holy, old Duke is summoned at the end of these. Right Ow! Alright, all the- The Boomer Duke has killed everyone, <laughs> oh no! <laughs> My bad, the Boomer Duke killed us. Let's try that again. Oh, oh wait, oh, what? Immediately. Oh! Okay. Immediately a thousand damage? Shooting. He's very fast. So the old Duke is doing a thousand damage to us in one hit, and he's moving just as fast as Duke Fishron, and by that, I mean it's faster than a speeding bullet. Uh, we thought fighting him in the water would help, but it turns out he's enraged no matter what, and he's going to kill us without even trying. So we stopped. Trying, that is. Uh, <laughs> we killed Dog again for more Cosmolite. 
And before fighting Yaren, I wanted to get a rover drive. To get it, we'd have to farm for wolfram enemies, but they hardly even spawn in the surface biome, even when we use a battle cry, which increases enemy spawns by like 30 times, if I remember right, maybe more. Whatever the case, we weren't getting the drive, and that was the last ingredient we needed to make the sponge, which is a super helpful accessory for survivability. It, it has so many uh, things in it, like a lot of calamity and game accessories that it's not worth trying to describe all the stuff. Look it up if you care. Not getting the rover drive made me want to fight a boss, so of course, I went back to Ravager. He just, he loves Ravager too much. And we need to beat him, he must die! We're, they're gonna have to be post s Cal. just accept it. <laughs> yeah, give him five back and then we'll beat him. We lost, and the boy successfully convinced me to help with farming for a few things in the Abyss, chief amongst them, the Reaver Sharks. Oh, is there's life. three colossal squids! <laughs> Only three. Dang, these things still have insane yeah. amount of health. Go for you, please! Woo! I'm the last oh, one that? with a That's bubble. Squids. All the time. Best time to find an idle on worm. It's so weird because I have water, water gravity and. Uh, hello, oh, it... Reaper Shark. How are you doing, good sir? He wants to oh, kill no. us dead. Oh no, I wasn't hit. Let's go. I'm still unhittable. Oh, we got Reaper Teeth. I am Thorbin the Invincible. Thorbin the I'm Invulnerable. Doing. Thorbin, the super cool dude. No, I lost my bubble immediately. I oh. still only have a bubble. <laughs> oh, I got I, hit. Oh. I teleported to it. <laughs> yeah. I'm proud of myself. I lasted a very long time. <clears throat> I'm the best. As long as you're proud of yourself. Um, Does that uh, Reaper Shark have feet? What? Wait, 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 what? <laughs> you see his legs. Do you see his legs? Yeah. Oh, I see it! Wait, what? What? <laughs> That's crazy, what? So, as it would turn out, reaver sharks have legs and arms. And yes, they're in the thumbnail. Um, you just gotta zoom in real close. One other thing we needed to farm was nightmare fuel. And, um, some other thing from the frost? I don't remember what it's called. We had to farm both moons, basically. It took a little while, and there were so many enemies on the screen, and I'm amazed my computer didn't burst into flames. Yeah, the two items that we just farmed from the event is not going into the system. Um... Yeah, maybe if we relog. Well, the ones that I put in there are now there. Yeah. Oh, they're gone now. Oh, yeah, they just dis they disappeared I just as I was what? What? I've never seen that before. We had to farm for them again real quick to see if they would disappear. We just needed to grab a few of the things and throw them back in. Okay, I put one in. Let's see what happens to it. It disappeared. Let's go. Let's go. Did it actually? I, I put one in there to see what happened and just disappeared. So I guess we can't get them, and I am itching to fight Jungle Dragon Yaren at this point, so I'm ignoring my friend's protest entirely. I feel like you're just gonna summon Yaren without telling us. Bless. Do not. The fact that he's not denying it makes me very concerned. I did make the summon and rushed over to the jungle arena, and I was so focused on that, I totally missed Winston making a shocking confession. Hey, so do you want to know something funny? Because oh, hey, I have like, I have 600 events. endothermic energy on me. All right, let's do it. Xander. <laughs> oh. <Zander>. oh. <laughs> Xander. Oh, he died, he died. Oh, well, we gotta fight, we gotta fight gear on. So as it would turn out, Winston was stealing all the stuff he had previously farmed for, and we thought it was a bug, but no, it was Winston. <laughs> we all had to coordinate a collective death to get Yaren to go away, since we're actually um, not ready for this battle at all. Plus he's at the house and enraged, and we're not doing any damage, so it's just not a good situation. But at least we have the endothermic energy, and oh, not, oh that's what it was called. That's, that's what it was, a nightmare fuel, which the boys claimed we needed, but it actually really was uh, the last thing we needed before giving Yaren an actual try. Did. Let's do it! Oh, that was pretty sick, actually. Who lives in a dragon on- Oh, we, oh we're gonna <laughs> fight. Nate is immediately dead. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, yeah, I just charged him and he died. Yeah, that wasn't fun. Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, massive fireball is following me. Oh, 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 it's just Obamna. Is that... You hey, Jake, got this, Obamna. Uh, no, I gotta start screaming again. Oh, oh no. Snake boy. No, no, I'm getting yeah. flashbacks. Yeah. No, I'm getting flashbacks. Two, to one, no. I'm in. I'm in. There goes all my health. <laughs> 
Yeah, yeah. Oh, the sun! That's so, uh, that's so scary! His, his, like, sun just moves around. That's not normal. No. Oh, yeah, yeah. oh, oh. It's, oh it's the second too. one sun goes away, a new one spawns in. It's, that's great. Well, probably, when he hits 50%, he probably does the whole thing where he goes in this, like, second phase like normal. Oh, yeah, so it's yeah. gonna be easy. It that's looks like we, right. we just need a tall arena, so maybe I should spawn him in a bit lower, so that way the base is lower. That's a sun! <laughs> He's back up to 100, guys! But it might as well be a revival. Oh! Huh? Yeah, he, he, he comes up to the hole. Yeah. Oh, I'm good. What? Oh! <laughs> Wait, this boss would still wreck us normally. Oh, no. Oh! No. This is not... This is bad. This is... <laughs> this is impossible! Are you kidding me? <laughs> Wait, Dragon Folly spawns his own walls, too. Wait, he does? Yeah. Oh. So there's gonna be more walls inside the walls. Oh, wait! Leave me alone! No! How do you dodge this? What is all this nonsense? Yeah, this was not no, no, this is not a movie, guys. It's beyond my control! My I really enjoy getting one hit by literally anything in the fight. Oh yeah, it's so much fun. Bumblebird is almost dead. Only 30%. I should What do you mean? When you're <laughs> you guys, yes, 300,000 health, he's almost dead. 3%, 2% right, for Bumblebird? Bumblebird's dead. dead! It's Dragon Folly, actually. Yes, or, yeah, whatever. Oh, he better not. I, <laughs> he's, he, he just, he just, you can't kill him. He just keeps going down to 50% and then re going up to 100. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's just a fun little quirk, you know? Still, yeah, yeah. you can't win. Oh, yeah, when you're oh, so this quirky. part of the song, yes, yeah, pretty, pretty <laughs> you sick. quirky little dragon boy. I told you! Oh, I, I love, love the oh sun! Yeah, oh, yeah. I don't wanna be here! I don't wanna be here! No, no. No! No! Yes, you had first Bumblebird, but what about second Bumblebird? In the end, I don't think we did awful. Our first step before resummoning was increasing the arena's vertical height. The walls forced a rather small horizontal arena, but there is no apparent limit vertically, so that can work. We could have expanded it more, but we didn't. Also, I made the platforms from the Martian blocks, and this is a great arena hack. The platforms glow, making them a whole lot easier to see. Sure, Martians are usually pretty late in progression, but hey, uh, I'm calling it an arena hack anyways. Uh, we died super early during the second battle, which was just poor performance on our part, and our third battle didn't get us any further than we did on the first attempt. The battle against Yuren is a little longer, so we fought Ravager four more times just to check him off of that boss checklist, and we did get real close, but he's just not dying. So we went back to the dragon. The fourth attempt saw no new progress. We added passive buffs like campfires, heart lanterns, and a bass statue or two. In the end, these did very little, but maybe something, just not enough to win the next battle. It wasn't until our sixth attempt that we uncovered a potential strategy. No, oh, bum over, we're almost dead. Oh, no, 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 no! Oh. Wait, Yuan's here. Wait, 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 still here! Bumble oh. Bumble left! <laughs> it worked! <laughs> it worked! It was right! The chatter was right! <laughs> oh, I mean, probably was. not what he envisioned, but... That's the strat, guys. Let Bumblebird kill all of us yeah. while one person's right about to it's, respawn, so Yaron easy. doesn't yeah. have time to run away. He was about to die anyway. Oh, Dragonfall is oh, back. Oh, Dragonfall is back. That yeah, was, yeah, that that was well. very fast. <laughs> That's kind of unfair, man. A person in chat, Hyper, he deserves some recognition as he's given us a lot of hints in this run. Um, he did offer the strategy uh, for this battle that involves despawning Dragon Folly, but when there are four people in the fight, that's incredibly hard to do, and we weren't sure it was possible, but this battle revealed it was indeed possible. So we just had to figure out how to do it reliably. The last time Dragon Folly despawned was immediately after all of us died, but Yerim took a, an extra second or two to leave allowing the boys to spawn back in, resulting in Dragon Folly leaving while Yaren stayed. Which isn't exactly something you can repeat easily. We expanded the arena more vertically and removed the platforms in the center of the arena to make it easier to fall and avoid the sun. Guys, the sun's coming down to hole. Oh, oh I can't get real low. I the can't fall. Real low. I can't <laughs> fall faster than it. This did help us a bit, but this did help a bit, but it all came down to just Snake Boy like it usually does, but Billy was about to spawn in and save the day. I'm here! Epic. I- he just- <laughs> I, I watched him go over the spawn, dude. That was so funny. I just spawned the sun on me, no! <laughs> I'm glad I could take aggro away for a few seconds. I'm here! <laughs> <laughs> 
We lost that, and it was the next one that we discovered we could actually make Dragon Folly despawn reliably. And that changes everything. <gasps> we can make him despawn! Yeah, but we he was targeting me, and I was just at the top of the arena. Oh, so if you get all go all the way up, he that's yeah. Far so if we have if whoever is targeting goes to the top, while everybody else runs to the and bottom, we dies. can get him to yeah, and then dives. We can get him to despawn. So for the rest of the battle, whomever Dragon Folly was targeting went to the top of the arena, while the rest of us stuck to the bottom. And once the person on top died, Dragon Folly would go away. In the end, this didn't keep the Dragon Folly from being a pain, as he'd respawn three seconds after leaving, which doesn't help a whole lot. But the new strategy did make it easier to do the classic multiplayer cheese of timing our respawning, and we took Garen down. Let's go! We did it! Yes! We did it. That was more like it. A boss that took many attempts. That was the challenge we were looking for, but even so, wasn't nearly as bad as several of the bosses in hard mode. But we still have two more bosses, and if Yaren was tough, then the other two have got to be even harder. We mined the new auric ore that spawned and realized in order to make the auric armor, we had to kill Ravager. Maybe not technically, but in theory, it'd be a whole lot faster than grinding out the stuff he dropped. So we fought him again and again. We still can't beat this thing. Until at long last. We got him. We got him. Yes. We did! Yeah! Yes! How is this like the hardest boss we've done in this game? <laughs> that was what, the thousandth attempt? Pretty sure that's right. Um, we did some more farming for the final accessories and weapons we needed and came to fight the Exomex. He has a gun! <laughs> you see he does. <laughs> yeah. What? He's aiming a gun at me. Oh. Why are you oh my gosh. Why here? This is a gun. That guy usually just sits in a chair. Him having a gun is New, guess he moved to America. Um, <laughs> I wanted to fight in the jungle arena, but Billy said the underworld would be fine. He was wrong. Um, it was bugged as all get out. All right, how, how much different is this going to be? It's a head right now. Uh, Below the map. The mini map. It looks completely broken. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Uh, is it just a head? Yeah. It is just a head. It's I going think we're great. not going to be able to. We're not going to be able to kill him, probably. And so we all had to coordinate our deaths, and we were having a really hard time with doing that. Do damage faster, darn you! <laughs> I wish it was yeah. okay. No, no, oh, Bob! Kill me! <laughs> Die you faster, darn it! <laughs> it's kind of funny when you're trying to lose, but struggle to do so. But I guess that's a good sign for the actual boss battle. He's here! It's, hey! It's, it's oh, we, we got, oh, oh the other two are here. 300,000 damage per second, let's go! Uh, oh yeah, I see one guys. of those health bars. It's, just, it's much oh, smaller I just now. Died, though. I'm all the boards. Oh, hi, friend. Alright, alright, got two of them down to about 50. Actually, wait, I gotta yeah. type. dead! <laughs> it's just you, Thorben. Come on, Thorben! Everything oh. was just on top of me in this uh, in uh, instant. Yeah. Was scary, okay, bro. good. Now you guys are back. Woo! I did my job. I did my job. <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait for the Ohio beam. Oh yeah, Ohio beam. I so long excited. to see you. Goodbye. I think no more him. Aries. Yeah, Unless yeah, he comes the twin, back. The, tw the twins are on me. There he the is. Ohio beam should be coming soon. Oh yeah, there's 500,000 DPS. Oh you said 500,000? Yes, he's what dead! What the heck? <laughs> what? That guy is nerfing that thing. 600,000 DPS, what the That's heck? That's insane! Oh, oh Ohio geez, Beam. Got it too fast. Oh, no Ohio, Ohio beam. beam got two of us! Ohio no, beam, the Ohio no. Beam is from the eyes. That was the Ohio Beam. I just died to it. Yep. Oh, oh it's just oh, both. So it's just me? Yeah, yeah I got five. We all died to the Ohio four, Beam. Three, yeah. two, one. That was an Ohio Beam! Oh. Yeah, that was that's the Ohio Beam. Trust me, it's. Oh, the oh my goodness! Dude, the Ohio Beam is so one fast. shot me on contact. Oh my gosh, what the? I'm just gonna hide in a corner. I'm gonna hide in a corner. I'm dead. I never know where it's gonna be. It's just hitting me. Oh, uh, no this is getting blanket. scary. I'm gonna die to the Ohio Beam. Oh no! Wait, this might actually work. Hold up. I have five. Guns. What? Dirt, what? Dirt, dirt block I'm works dead. against Ohio Beam. <laughs> <laughs> oh, leave me alone! Leave me alone! No, Ohio Beam is defeated by Dirt Block! You can still get hit by the dashes, but if you're not being targeted, you can hide behind Wait, blocks three, and you'll be two. fine. Of course the Ohio Beam is, like, insanely overpowered. This is, this is my oh. spot, get away! Get, get right, I got 10 seconds. No, you brought him to no, me! I 10 seconds, guys! 10 seconds! We got two of them, we got two. Oh, we got one, we got Bo. Five. There's oh, so on, much Jake. happening, I'm gonna die. 
He wants in a million health. Uh -oh. I'm not even getting, getting hit by the Ohio beam and I'm still dying. Yeah, I'm dead. Oh, that Ohio beam hit me. Uh oh. The box works. The box? The box oh works! God, <laughs> I can't do this though. <laughs> he's dead. Oh, that I'm dead. Uh -oh. All right, oh, he's over here. Three percent. Three percent. What's that sound too? It's one. One percent. It's dead. Point five. Come three on. two. Yes! We got him. First try. And so we get new weapons. Only we get more weapons than we thought because Winston discovered something that changed everything. I'm the mech. Wait, he's how the did mech. you do that? Because we had some shadow spec in the system. Excuse me? What? what? I, wait, wait, wait. We had Shadow That's Spec? Right. What are because you talking we, about? We get Ashes of Annihilation. <gasps> oh, I, forgot. Right. I forgot we had that. See, some of the special drops from other bosses have allowed us to craft Escal's Shadow Spec bars, meaning we can get endgame gear before the endgame boss. So, we did some quick farming, made our endgame gear. What the heck is that? <laughs> <laughs> what am I looking at? <laughs> so what are you talking about? It's the best weapon in the game. And summoned the final boss. Let's go. Um, okay. Do you enjoy going through hell? She's here. I guess. Oh. I don't see a box though. Lost connection. Uh, oh. It, I didn't get advice oh, that you left. <laughs> I didn't either. <laughs> the world just froze. That's not a good sign. She just you destroyed just, the world! She just said you should have just died and then killed me. <laughs> Wait, what? You, you can't beat the game, you just die. <laughs> she, she said you should have just died, started moving, and just, like, teleport on top of you and killed me. It's just Wait. an update that doesn't cause more problems. Uh, uh, <laughs> what? I think I... I oh, what the heck? Where's Winston? Do, yeah, do we have everyone here? No. Winston? Did Escal get him? Maybe. Yeah, she actually like came to his house. <laughs> it's the real horror of this mod. Yeah, he's never saw him again. Every time we try and spawn it in, someone's gonna go missing. Yep, who's next? It's one of us three. <laughs> Spooked. Not it. Not it. Not it. Uh, no, you're no. last. Ah! You're screwed. Oh no! You, you know guys, I think we already have done enough. There's no need to spawn. <laughs> yeah, I wanna go missing. Let's try that again. All right, let's, let's do it. Let's, let's All right, let's see what happens. Wait, hang on. That's no, don't, work, don't, no, it? don't spawn it now. Spawn it. She's invincible it, at this point. It broke, it broke again. Did it? Are you sure? Uh, no, it didn't. no, it looks fine to me. Yeah. Uh -huh. The box is not um, solid. Oh, so it's, you can go through it. Uh. Sort of, but it's oh, like don't you have to kill Sepulcher? In... Yeah, you can get stuck in the walls. Oh, yeah, hold up. I there's a wall, I couldn't even see it. Oh, wait, yeah, wait. The, the wall's invisible. Yeah, wall is invisible. That's so but you can weird. see it on a mini map if you run That's into it. Wait, it's, just... Not, it's just blending in with the background. Yeah, it's just blending with the background, and also it's not solid. Oh, actually, yeah, now I see it. Yeah, yeah. Just make sure you stay in the box because she gets enraged if you don't. Oh, oh yeah. what just hit me? I do not we even know. We might have to define, like, make our own barrier so that way... Nah. Unless we just beat it, then it doesn't matter. I mean, she is already at 63... 60%. Yeah, we're... we're it's, oh, it's he's summoning good. the death laser. I almost uh, just said that... Oh, I, didn't, I, I, sh I didn't know she has... Oh, that, one, that died in no did. time at all. No? <laughs> I, oh, yeah, they did. I yeah, shot each of them dead. once, and they're dead. It's a laser. <laughs> Oh, of course oh we're already in last phase. Yay, Yay. meatballs! On top oh, oh, of so spaghetti. Oh, I'm chasing you. <laughs> ah, I'm stuck. <laughs> All covered with funny. cheese, calamitous meatball. When she rolled out the door. Nate, don't die. Yeah, I'm no, trying not to, block. but I'm stuck. Yeah. Oh no, I'm stuck in the walls. Here, I'm, I'm so, I don't know where they are. It's so easy, no. dude. I think we're- are we on bullet hell again? <laughs> no, nope, we can still hit her. We're not, we're not, okay. Oh, dude, we got her to I'm 10% good. already. Let's go! Did we one-shot Escal and we couldn't do, beat Ravager? We yeah, couldn't literally. beat Duke. Like, dude, hard mode was stupidly- Sepulchre's dead. Uh, yep. she's- she's vulnerable. Go through it, go through it. Can hit her. Oh, she's she didn't go through it. Yes, uh, let's go! Yeah, that's it. Dude, what? <gasps> 
Hey, what's up, lady? No way. Smooch. We did that. <laughs> so How easily. dare you? That was the walk in the park. Dude, what? That's just it. <laughs> that is, that's very anticlimactic, gotta say. And that was legendary Get Fixed Boy Calamity post Moon Lord. And it was way easier than hard mode, which is really bizarre. But there were a few bosses we did miss that were added to the seed exclusively. But to the best of my knowledge, none of these bosses are actually meant to be beaten. They're more memes than anything else. Even so, we'll probably try to beat them and I'll probably make a separate video of us fighting them along with probably old Duke and Nameless Deity.